something special. Something called living water. Living water. I've never had living water. I had soapy water, vitamin water, even the sunny water. But what in the world was living water? So I asked Jesus to tell me. Jesus told me that this living water was a very, very special water and that it can only come from God and that nobody else can give you this. Living water was, was the most special kind of water that anyone could ask for. Jesus told me that his water was the kind of water where I would never, ever be thirsty again. Well, this seemed like so fabulous to me because I was so tired of walking down this well and carrying all these heavy buckets that the thought of me never having to do that again was awesome. So Jesus told me that if I would just accept this water, then I would never have to do that again. So I told him, yes, I want some of this living water. Well, Jesus told me that this living water wasn't like regular water. I couldn't go to my well and get it out, and I couldn't get it from a bottle that this was a water that would bubble up inside of me like a well and that would flow into eternal life. And then I couldn't go to Walmart, and I couldn't go to Target, or I couldn't go to Lowe's Food to buy this water, that only God himself could give me this special water. So then all of a sudden, the conversation changed. Jesus started talking all about me. He started telling me that he knew I was married, how many husbands I had had, and that I now was with a man who wasn't my husband. And so I thought to myself, how does he know all this stuff about me? He didn't ask me any questions, and I haven't really told him about myself, but he already knew everything about me. So I thought to myself, oh my goodness, this man, he must be very, very special. Maybe he's a prophet. So, so then I, I thought to myself, I want to try to impress this man. So I started talking about different kinds of worship and, and that the great Messiah was coming. I didn't know anything about this stuff. I was just being, I don't know, I was pretending. I wanted him to like me. And more, more, more so, I wanted him to think that I was so, so smart. And then he looked at me, and you know what he said? He says, I am the great Messiah. All this time, I have been talking to this man who I thought was nobody, and he was the great Messiah. I was shocked that I didn't know what to do because I was in amazement that I was talking to someone that was so special that I just didn't know what to do anymore. This man was the great Messiah. So then he looked at me, and you know what he did? He offered me some of his very, very special holy water. Give her a hand. Oh, I almost forgot. I 
brought a friend. You brought a friend? She's a little shy. A little shy. Whoa. <laughs> come on, come on up here and say hi.